This is hydrogen tap. What we're looking at here is a second of two videos showing the Aaron cell. There's only four plates in this system. We're running off of a 12 volt battery that is being charged, so we're actually getting 14 volts out of it. There's the amount of amps that it's drawing, which is 2.70. The Aaron cell is probably as close to the mark as you can get. The plates are stainless steel 0.028. They're, six, they're about six inches long. And they are stainless steel. The space between the plate is about one eighth of an inch any closer and you start having trouble with the bubbles going between the plates any farther apart and you won't get as much gas. I'm sure you can tweak the system up by making the plates maybe a 32nd of an inch closer more or less but I don't believe that's necessary because what we're shooting for is the pulse system as you can see, there's the meter across the battery, which is 14 volts, 14.16. Remember, there's only four plates in this cell. If you go to hydrogentap.tap.com, you can see these and the others. The system that comes with a 3LR1000 has 15 plates. So you can imagine how much gas is coming up from that. As I showed you before, this cell is, the plates are separated by the plastic squares. This is 56. We're going to measure the temperature of the water and restart it again. So you have more data to go by. It's about 56 degrees. I've had a number of questions about pulsing systems that aren't working out there. Myers did not run straight pulses. In order to make it work, you have to have a certain number of pulses per second, plus the pulse has to stay on for a certain length of time. The width of the pulse has to be a particular length of time. The system that I'm putting together now, I'll be able to vary both the number of pulses per second and the length of time the pulse stays on. Again, if you use the 555 timer system, you can work with that. As you can see, the amount of hydrogen that this is producing either at around 60 degrees is considerable. Those leads going to the cell are really heavy. It's number 10 wire.